The first time I ever got suspended, bro, was when I had gone to a, uh, I wouldn't say a fight, but I say like a heated altercation with this fat Indian kid. But he was like, he was smart. His name was, his name was William. He was a fat Indian kid. He was always like saying like sarcastic shit. And he felt like he had to write because he was the smart, the smart kid in the class. You feel what I'm saying? Saying sarcastic shit. And he had a, had a lisp too. So look, bro, at the front of the class, you feel me? He had like said some shit out the way. You feel me? Like maybe if you were paying attention, you would get the answers right. Or some shit like that. You feel what I'm saying, Kerr Plunk? Maybe if you were paying attention, you'll get the answers right. Like who the fuck you think you talking to, William? You feel what I'm saying? That's what I didn't say that, but that was in the back of my head. You feel what I'm saying? I'm in like the sixth grade, and he think cause he he just a smart kid. You feel me? In the front of the class, he could just turn around and say shit occasionally to the kids in the back. You feel me? The cool kids and shit. I was in the back. You know what I mean? Class clown, not really paying attention to all that educational shit. You feel what I'm saying? Stay in school, kids. I'm just saying. That's that's me. I wasn't really focused on much of that. Feel what I'm saying? So then he had said something crazy to me. I, it's holes in the classroom. I gotta make sure I'm looking, you know, looking like I, I got some some fighting skills or some 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 verbiage. So I get up. You feel me? I'm walk up to him. You know who do you think you talking to? You feel what I'm saying? Walk up to him, flex on him a little bit. You know he looked like he about to tell the teacher or some shit and then I just hit him just hit him I don't know why I did this I don't even think it was necessary like thinking back wasn't never necessary to hit this dude you feel me hit him and then he got up his face was turning red he like was really like screaming like he was about to just fucking explode he's screaming and then like he started swinging the nigga started swinging at me like windmilling. So I had like, I had defended myself. I hit him again, you feel me? He like start crying, you feel me? So it was like, I felt like a bully. I ain't gonna lie. I felt like a bully. But people were so happy. I also felt like the neighborhood hero because this nigga was, was saying shit under his breath and getting away from, like this nigga was undefeated with saying, saying shit under his breath. I'm talking about like 35 and old the whole school year. He'd say some shit, get other niggas in trouble, and then you feel me, like just go back into his learning. So I felt like the neighborhood hero when I had to hit the nigga in this shit. You feel what I'm saying? Like, I feel like everybody was, yeah, you feel me? Thank you, you feel me? Like, and then all of a sudden, like, I felt like a bully as well though, cause he ain't really, he wasn't ready to, like like that for real he wasn't ready to type to fight and all that you feel me i'm not no fighter either though i was never the type to really engage in fights and shit like that it was just like that was a moment you know i wasn't thinking straight long story short i got suspended i had to apologize to william you know what i mean and he was in the office crying it's, it's okay you feel me i got suspended afterwards i thought the apology was like canceled it all out no they still suspended a nigga Thing is, William stayed at school. I'm like, damn, he don't even get suspended. He's, he was swinging back. William man stayed at school. So I'm like, you know what, shit, let me just take this L, this little five-day suspension. Literally a whole week, Monday through Friday. Five-day suspension, man, took the L. You know what, came back feeling like the neighborhood hero. Shit is crazy. I'm telling you, dead ass, swear to God. Uh, got me over here thinking back through my memories. Oh, I got so many crazy memories, man. Thing is, I don't even, I don't even like fighting. You know what I mean? Cause you swung first, probably so. You know, that's that's how they do it. I don't even like fighting though. That's the thing, bro. Like I, I don't fight unless I need to. You feel me? Or it's like a defense. You feel me? I'm, I'm a loving person. I'm a loving. I love talking. I love like roasting you feel me i was always a big head ass little shoes ass big pants ass you feel me i'm all i was the lunch table roaster but it was also times where people would take that to a fence you feel me take me roasting into a fence and who the, what the fuck you say to me you feel me like it was those people who couldn't take a joke and i had to feel me like protect myself from these niggas 
Because they wanted to. You feel what I'm saying? Back up, nigga. Wait a minute. Back the fuck up. I was just joking. This is what I do. Feel what I'm saying? Like, that's all I did, bro. I was never the fighting type. So I felt like that suspension was like, that's sus- that first suspension gave me like a, a outlook of what I didn't want, bro. I ain't never like got suspended again after that. I think I got suspended like, no, I, I got suspended, but I only got suspended like twice out of my whole school, school situation. I ain't gonna lie. Five days ain't bad. Really? I think five days was a stretch for real, bro. You missed a whole week of school. I know people who got longer though, so I guess you're right. I guess you're right. Um, I remember it being like a two day, three day, five day. I know a nigga that got suspended for like a whole month. Niggas ain't niggas got expelled like for shit, for doing what niggas the niggas got expelled for smoking weed in the school. Niggas got expelled for uh. Punching the principal. Like niggas was they was getting niggas up out of there left and right at my old schools, man. A month is crazy. Hell yeah, niggas come back like nothing happened. Like, nigga, you got suspended for a month. Nigga, you was on the you was on the newsletter at the you was on the morning announcements, nigga. They told us about that. You ain't you ain't think we was gonna hear about that? Fucking in the bathroom is crazy, Kurt Plunk. Who was fucking in the bathroom? That's you gotta be bold as hell to fuck in the bathroom, bro. Niggas is coming in there left and right. In the restroom? The stalls don't even be open like that. The stalls don't even be like secure like that. You can see feet. It was times where we was walking in there to see who the fuck was using the restroom in the stalls. We'll look at their shoes. Just so we could roast they ass when they came out. Oh, you you was in there taking a the shit, wasn't you? Yes, you was, cause nigga, them the sketches that I seen in there. You was taking the shit, wasn't you, Timmy? Your nasty ass. You ain't wash your hands either, cause I counted the time. Big shoe, little bowl cut head ass. Like we was in there, like literally waiting for them niggas to come out the restroom after seeing they shoes. Up under the up under the shit. Like we would look under the stall. Like not look under the shit, but like we would look, you feel me? Be near the sink, see niggas shoes, and then see them later on in the day. <laughs> Dead ass. Like this shit was man. Legit need to have balls of steel if you doing it in the bathroom. Facts. But if you doing anything in the bathroom, bro, you gotta have balls of steel. If you taking a shit, nigga, you better Turn into a spider. Your legs better be hanging above the stall. <laughs> I remember it was a nigga in there taking a the shit. He had his legs up against the stall door. So you couldn't see it was nobody up under there in that stall. But you smelled some shit, though. Like, who the fuck is in here shitting? You look up under there, there ain't no legs. You can't see no legs, shoes, nothing. But it's a nigga up there with it holding his legs up. Like, he... <laughs> Nigga holding his legs up like he like we can't s- smell his ass. You look through the cracks, it's a nigga like this. Holding his damn legs up. Hey nigga, we smell your stank ass. Shit is funny, bro. <clears throat> damn everybody be fucking in the bathroom, they do it on the stair. That's crazy. Did you go to college? I went to college for one year, bro. I didn't I didn't finish. You feel me? I dropped out. Tripper C. 